Hey, what's up, everybody? It's TJ with Sanctified Homes, and today I'm here with Andrew from CTW Flooring. And today we're going to answer everything about pet friendly flooring. So, Andrew's been kind enough to lay out a bunch of the better options for pets from carpet to the backers we're going to talk about to just some of your flooring options if you have pets whether it's dogs cats or i don't know it seems like people have yeah, exotic well animals. they're posting about these mini cows in their house now oh really <laughs> mini versus too yeah <laughs> so why don't you give us a rundown um you could start wherever you want obviously carpet depends on the backer you put under it yeah so they you know nowadays carpets um you know, if you if you love carpet and love the feel and warmth of carpet, and you have pets, kids, things like that that mm -hmm. spill or have messes, carpet nowadays comes with a, a, a backing on it that's impervious to water, moisture. So something like this, you put this in and you spill, mm -hmm. moisture is not going to get down to the padding. Mm -hmm. So the biggest thing in terms of getting stains and things like that out of carpet is actually stopping it from getting to the pad. Because if you, you know, if you, if it does get into the pad and you're able to clean the carpet, you know, a day or two passes, that, that uh, liquid or that stain will actually wick back up. Sure. So if, if carpet is your, you know, your main option for um, your application and you have mm -hmm. pets, things like that, I would definitely recommend going with one with a spill proof on it. Okay. Um, just helps the longevity of the, the carpet and staining. Yeah. Things like that. That makes sense. So then you're not having to buy those pet friendly pads. Exactly. Kind of yeah. But it's built into this. Exactly. Okay. Yep. So oh, yeah, do, that makes sense. Do that. Yeah. Um, other options, obviously waterproof options, you know, pet friendly. Um, you got the luxury vinyls. So we've got luxury vinyl plank or luxury vinyl tile. Now, just basically the difference in these solely is the look. Um, you've got wood or you've got stone looks. The nice thing about luxury vinyl is it's it's waterproof. So say you have a mess, you'll be able to clean it right up. Um, Timeline wise, you really don't have too, like a, a set time frame in terms of cleanability because it's a waterproof floor. Right. Now these two that I'm showing are both the glue down options mm -hmm. in the luxury vinyl. What about, I get if pets make a mess, kids, maybe we drop something. Yep. yep. What about I spill wine. Yeah, well, so if you spill, does you, it depend on what the floor is, or realistically, no. I mean, oh, really? I mean, okay. yeah, the you know moisture is not going to get into okay. into okay. the graining or anything like that okay. of of these types of floors. Now, say you put in a real solid hardwood, yeah, finish is worn off or something like that. Yeah, that's probably getting into the wood right. where you'd have to sand it out. Yeah, but being more pet friendly, these options okay. are. Um, or, you know, kid-friendly, life-friendly, messy-friendly. Yep. These are definitely the better options. Okay. Now, this here is also a luxury vinyl plank, just like the ones I showed you. This is the click-together version. So you can use this. This is 100% waterproof as well. But with a click-together floor of something like this, moisture would end up getting under this type of a floor um, with whatever reason, pets, um, kids, you know, spilling drinks. You would have to unclick this floor let it dry out and then re-click it back. But most of the time, your floor is gonna be still stable. Mm -hmm. Still able to be reused with uh, with a click floor. Yep. Um, and is that more just, it's not like you're getting it at the seams unless it was not installed properly. Exactly. It's more like, cause it's floating. Yeah. So yep. at the ends, it could, in theory, if some a kid spills the pet peas on the wall, it could get under and on this. It, it could, yeah. This is glued tight and it's not gonna navigate it. Exactly, yep, yep. One thing though that, you know, like saying that though, you know, moisture can, if you do the click floating versions, moisture can get in those seams, okay. but it typically, it takes a while. You know what I mean? Like, so you you, gotta clean it up. yeah, you'd have about, I, I think most of them is about 24 hours. Okay. Um, You'd have in terms of getting that moisture off before it would get in between the seams. Okay. Makes sense. Of the click option. Yeah. Um, We also have got laminates, which is just like the, click together luxury vinyl option, mm -hmm. just a little bit of a different construction. So laminates typically are not gonna be completely waterproof like the luxury vinyl would be. So if you got moisture underneath it, if it gets into the core, this core typically will swell. Yep. Um, and then not be able to be reused. But in terms of like topical moisture, you're gonna be safe, kind of like with the luxury vinyl click together, yep. you know, you'd be safe for about up to a day Yep. to get that moisture out before it starts getting into seams. Yep. 
Um, the one thing basically that, you know, there's pros and cons, like I said, to both of these, but the, the thicker floors, the click together floors are going to be softer under your feet. Um, they, you know, they're just going to be a little bit more dense, yep. warmer. So, yep. I mean, it, this one is right. Maybe not as impervious exactly. as these are. Yes. However, the durability of a pet running over this yes. is better than these. Right. One hundred. My understanding. Yes. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Yep. The yeah, the finish on a laminate, the the newer laminates these days is a tougher finish in terms of scratching, denting, things like that. So yeah, okay. big big dogs. I would probably lean towards a, a laminate. Okay. To be honest with you, bigger yeah. pets. Um, bigger kids that wear their cleats in the house. <laughs> things, things, things. Plus ice yeah, skates, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Rollerblading around in the house. Nope. So that's uh, that's definitely a really good option for um, kids, moisture, things like that from the top down. Yeah. Um, another yeah. less common type of flooring is actually your rubber floors. So you know, like your Anytime Fitnesses or your Planet Fitnesses, your gym floor. Yep. That's actually a very good floor too. Okay. And it can come rolled good, so it's literally four feet wide by however long you need. So there's not as many seams in the floor. Yeah. Um, but in terms of moisture protection, things like that, a rubber floor would also be yeah. a very, very good option. Is that, are you mostly seeing that like in a basement or a garage? Yeah. Or? yeah, so we see, I mean, realistically, like residential applications, they're in basements, they're in their workout rooms. Yeah. Um, you know, even mud rooms, sometimes people are putting this in just because it's it's almost indestructible. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's, and insulative properties, it's very insulated. Yeah, it's definitely so, on your feet. Exactly. Right. Yeah, so, you know, basements, things like that. If you had a little area where you had, you know, some workout equipment, things like that, or, you know, they, they've come a long way in terms of colors. You know, some people like this just as their normal floor. Yeah. You know, sure. just their everyday floor, and it's it's very, very durable. Okay, yeah. Well, hey, guys, we hope you like this video about, you know, flooring for your pets. If you have more detailed and specific questions about whatever you have, size of pets, stuff like that. Yeah. Just reach out to Andrew. We'll have his information on here below the video somewhere. He can answer all of those for you. Uh, if you're looking for flooring, obviously reach out to him as well. He doesn't just uh, work with us, obviously. Yeah. You do. Uh, you can be a residential real, owner. Yeah. Just reach out to him. Yeah. Whatever it might be. Uh, in the meantime, obviously, make sure you guys are liking, subscribing, and sharing. If you want to know more stuff about different flooring, tile, whatever yeah. that might be, totally reach out. We'll make more videos with them if this is the kind of stuff you guys want to see. So we're here to help educate you, so make sure you're hitting that like, share, subscribe button. And don't forget to raise your standard. We'll talk to you guys soon.